I'm not sure why this guy looks so serious. Anyways, welcome to Wolfenstein The New Order. I wanted to give a big thank you to all of you. Because every series I've done this year, you guys have made a hit. And I can't thank you enough. I hope this one does well as well. Uh, but what I was going to say before we started was I'm giving away two copies of this game. Any system preference. If you want a chance to win, just leave a comment with your console choice below. And I'll select the winner about a week after this video has been up. And I'll probably announce it on Twitter and on this video. So, thank you for everything. It'd be awesome to see this. With Infamous Second Son was the last big series we had. I don't know how many likes we got on that. I think like 80,000. That's insane. If we got half of that on this video, I would be, I would be happy. So, uh, this is a long game. I wanted to show you when you start a new game really quick. This is probably the funniest thing I've seen at the start of any game. They take the most simple thing like picking a difficulty and add a little twist. Br bring him on as the medium difficulty. I am death incarnate. He looks a little more pissed. Uber. Yeah, he's got blood on his face. Red eyes. Don't hurt me. He has a little scared O face. And then can I play daddy? I like how it says very easy difficulty setting for the spineless gamer. That's a big insult. Alright, so I am playing this on PlayStation 4. Just, uh... I don't know if my computer could run it, and I had an option to get it for 360, but it's four discs, and I just didn't feel like swapping them, so. With that being said, let's do this, and I hope you enjoy. In my dream, I smell the barbecue. I hear children. A dog. And I see someone. I think I see someone. These things, none of it for me. Not moved by roaring engines. Not lone warriors. We come from the night. I saw Bob Blaskowitz. You keep a lookout. I need to go to the pass. A shark! Oh shit! All right, clamp the fuel line. So this game is pretty long. Okay, mine came with a, a Doom beta. Oh, that's the thing back there. Let's see what we need. This plays just like the old game. Let's see what we got. You need tools, tools cabinet. Okay, it's in the cockpit. I guess that's what this is over here. I saw this at a corner of my eye. I only played the start of this game uh, just probably about 10 minutes just so I get used to the controls. What is this? Do we have time to read this? Really? Nazis constructing super weapons. Uh, July 5th, 1946. It's around the World War II. So it ties in. This game, when it starts picking up, I think you guys will really enjoy it. Oh, damn. Look at the health going down. There's a lot of in-game dialogue. I'm going to try my best to not talk over the characters talking, but there's a lot of chaos going on. What? There we go. Oh, shit. Look at these graphics. I don't know if there's a time limit, but I know that this shit is holding us down a little bit. Dump the cargo. Okay, it's good. Let's go back. Turn to the cockpit. Oh shit! What the fuck? I haven't gotten past this plane area, so... I think this is actually as far as I got when I pulled up back here. Hop on the turret. Oh shit, are you kidding? This is old school, baby! Long guy, I'm good. So I know this is kind of it. I've definitely the other Wolfenstein game. It's been a long time since they released one. Okay, we're good on that. Anything coming right at us? Oh shit! Ooh. Oh shit! Oh, 
Oh, what? I've always liked these games. It kind of reminds me of Metro Last Light a little bit with the futuristic tie-in to like old school type stuff. Oh, come on, man. Oh, no. Oh, come on, man. What? Death at the gates again. All in my name. Can't greet you today. I have a war to win. <laughs> You're still breathing, you dumb bastard. Uh, it's tough as they come, you know. Jesus Christ. Hey there! Vulture one, coming, Vulture one. Red pack three, Blasco, use it. Play now, you're not scanty. Hey, hold on now, this is Vulture one. You're crowding me, he's off. That other plane is awfully close, guys. Gonna help us out, I guess. Oh shit! Can I take cover? You see the pilot's wheel. Yes, sir! Engine grab it as hard as you can with both hands and pull it towards you. Don't turn it behind you. Just keep it level. Just pull it towards your chest. Okay, sir. There we go. Oh, there we go. What are we supposed to do? Just, oh, he's just, he's jumping shoot. He said, fuck it. Oh, but hang on. Just by luck. Look at that shit. Run forward and leap. What the hell? I didn't get far enough. Yeah, I didn't. Oh, shit. I, I'm dead. I gotta do that again. That was embarrassing. Here we go, guys. That's as far as I go. This graphics are really nice. Sir, what's the score, Cat? Die, son. Same as always. Hoorah, sir. I like how when you talk to different characters, like a cutscene plays. I don't think it's always like that, but that's what I've noticed so far. Now, I will say this if you buy it for PlayStation 4, I, I did have a 5 gig install on top of this. So when you get hit in this game, it's like. Oh wait, hang on, let me see what this is. He slapped him a couple times. Oh no! I can't see anything. Oh, 
Oh shit! It's the break of dawn. July 16, 1946. Everything has gone to shit. Nazi war machine is advancing at an astonishing rate. We can't catch up. Our tactics are failing. Outclassed and outgunned. No one knows why. People are getting desperate. Not me. I'm here to see an old friend and settle a score. Turn this thing around. <laughs> Oh my goodness, what the fuck? There goes that futuristic stuff just bringing it in. Fergus, what's your status? Ah, uh, Blazkowicz. We've got a scatter of bad ways over here. Trapped inside an aircraft, well, some kind of armored hell beast is trying to fucking eat us. No joke. I'm the same problem here. Shacked up inside dead wreckage. Is that you over there? The private wires flash your lights. Uh, Blasco, can you see the light? Wait, turn off the light, turn it off. Yes, sir. I see you. What can I do for you? We can't get to it from out of position. Not that they're fucking trapped in here. But if you can access a cockpit turret on this here aircraft, you might be able to kill the beast. Regular small arms sure don't work for bug at all. Hey, perhaps you can swim here. Just keep your head down below the surface. You should be all right. Good plan, Fergus. Coming to you. Yeah, I love how they do that. It's like an instant cutscene. Break creates. Oh wow, overcharge. Oh, that basically just something that drifts down a little bit. Oh my goodness. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Oh, watch out. Oh, we got something over here. Overcharge. A uh, more overcharge. How many can you do? You'd probably go up to 200. That's what I'm guessing. So I'm trying to get away from the Hell Beast. That's what they call it. I remember the Wolfenstein games. Oh shit. Do we go up to the shore? I mean, I want to stay low, but I'm gonna go up and get some oxygen. I'm not sure how this game works with that. All right, we're going back down. And we're gonna follow this line right here. That's everyone who's been getting killed by this stuff. Here's the thing, I don't- Oh, what the fuck is that? Holy shit! Holy shit, guys, that thing is huge! Looks like that thing off that movie, The Mist, at the very end. Alright, here we go. We finally made it. I'm not sure how I held my breath that long, but we definitely made it. Oh, here we go. Swim to the airplane turret. We got this. Kill the mechanical beasts. There's one right there trying to get him. Yeah, take it, bitch! Oh, there's another one. What about that thing? I can't shoot it. Meet up with the team. All right. So since this game is so long, uh, there's two different campaigns, I think. Hang on. All right. Listen up. There's a high-powered machine gun nest in those trenches over there. We cannot advance a unit without being slaughtered. So, I want you to make your way over into those trenches and take the nest out. Just run as fast as you possibly bloody can straight up the middle. We'll lay down cover fire from here. Got it. Ah, I'll put this on. I'll radio updates from our position. Right, lads. You ready to lay down suppressor fire? All right, here we go, guys. Get the hell out of here. This shit is crazy as fuck. If Doom is anything like this, it's gonna be amazing. Oh shit, time to go. What we got? Oh, hand grenades, finally. Let's look at the weapon will we got. Apparently you can dual wield different assault rifles. It like the old Wolfenstein games, you can do a lot of that stuff, but it's far between. I guess you're supposed to throw a grenade up there. Holy shit! Jesus! Oh, I'm in a crater. What? Move 
Oh yeah, I heard about this. This looks so strange. It's basically the lean out, lean down and out. But they wanted you to go under this door right here. Shoot them legs, baby. Oh nice. Oh shit. Okay, now which one did I just I just picked up the uh I can't tell if this is an AK-47 or not. I am playing this on the medium difficulty. I wanted to just kind of stay neutral and see how it is. I did play on Uber, just kind of messing around, and uh, I didn't get that far. <laughs> I didn't get past the, the airplane turret part where all the planes are flying everywhere. Come on, bitch, bring it! Okay, I think we're good. Oh yeah, I wanted to say thank you so much for any support you drop on this video. Oh my goodness, look at this guy. I hope to see this series do well. It's really one of those, I don't know what kind of crowd it'll pull in. I mean, maybe some old school gamers in here. Wolfenstein goes way back. Yeah, I think if I put on anything higher than this, it would be me raging every time. Let's head back this way. Yeah, take it, bitch! It, it really, you know what I will say, that it definitely feels just like the old Wolfenstein games. They really did a great job. I've been playing their games since, like, Fallout. So do I have it? Oh, I, I got it dual wielded. Holy shit. Toggle dual wielding. This right here, guys, is where it's at. Oh, right, let's view the map. So right now, we're right there. We got to go all the way down through the trenches. I don't think you need this, though. This, <laughs> this is a little bit overkill. Can you get that? No. Heavy ammunition. That's all I need, really. Yeah, I think everything else is good. You can't go that way. This is basically just a side area. I'm gonna try to put the entire first mission in this video, so we'll just have to see what happens. Oh, we're going, we're going. What the hell? Are you kidding? I'm trying to get the headshots, but this thing has some heavy ass recoil, I'll say that. All right, guys, you're supposed to come back this way and go this route right here. This is the only way you can get there. What was that? Oh, there's a big machine. Look at that thing. I don't know if you can take that thing down. It might be the end of the mission if you do. We're trying to stay in the trenches. Oh, my goodness. Is it just standard bullets? Can take yeah, it can take it down. So if I'm not mistaken, the way the story is set up, it's kind of, it's like after World War II. Oh my goodness, what the fuck? Oh shit, that was so sick. All right, as long as you don't go down in 20, over 20 increments, you'll actually see where it went back up to 100. That's mainly because uh, if you go to like 81, it'll go back up to 100. But if you go to like 80, I think it just stays there. And if you go below 80, like to 70, it'll go back up to 80, but not 100. If that if that makes any sense. So basically, we went up from the back left and went all the way up to come back around towards the middle to get past that area. We got it. We have to go this way though. Overcharge. Let's do this. <laughs> Don't you see the? You see the bullets flying everywhere? What the fuck? Here we go. So it plays very responsive. It reminds me of like Quake, where it's like everything you do is just, it's 100% you. There's no like game really interfering with it. Damn man, there's so many of them. I would dual wield, but that's just gonna waste ammo. How about that bitch? There we go. How did he, what? How did he live through that? I was going to ask you when you actually found my YouTube channel. 
uh, whether it's this video or another series. I've done so many games now. I've been doing this since April of 2010. Yeah, we're going up this way. And I've enjoyed, I've enjoyed doing this stuff so much. Uh oh, it's your ass. Oh, right in the back. What? I got a new gun. I feel like I'm about to lose all this stuff, though. That or I'm just getting it early. Can I sneak up behind this guy? Oh, what? <laughs> I thought I was going to do something with, like, the electricity. That's what it looks like. Now right, let's get out of here. Oh, shit, the back of my neck. I got to hold my neck for a minute. <laughs> that was probably super brutal. Take out commanders, okay. Those are the... Oh shit, there's more hand grenades back there. I didn't even... I have to look for that. Signal detected. Alright, we're getting close. Oh, I guess you can do... Every scenario, you can do two different things. You can be stealthy, or you can run in guns blazing. I'm gonna just try to get this guy really quick. Oh, right in the throat, bitch. Okay, I took out the commander, but... Is that everything? I can't guarantee I'm going to be stealthy 100% of the time. But I'll definitely try my best. Because anything to do... What is that? Throw knife. Oh, that... I'm... Oh, I missed. You know, it's weird. I threw it, and I thought it would uh, go a little further than it did. I guess I was wrong. I'll right, just go back over here. So I took out the commander. Oh, I guess you go through here now to get to that. Picking up the armor is the most helpful thing. Uh-oh, his leg to the floor. We found the first uh, graphical error, guys. Game's over. No, I really don't care about all that. I do think they did a great job with the frame rate. Bomb needed. So when I come back, I need to get that bomb from the other side. So I guess we got to go to the thing on the right over here and get the bomb. I got to pay a lot closer attention. It seems like the overcharge is going to keep gonna keep everything else at bay. Let's look at this gun. What the hell does this thing do? It's old school. Indiana Jones type shit. Dual wield knife. What? Yeah, I like just a plain old assault rifle. It's like they want you to go in guns blazing. There's so many overcharged things. Uh-oh, sideswipe. I bet, yeah, oh my goodness. What the fuck? Oh, did, who his head popped off? What? I didn't know they had that in this game. Hopefully, I'm not too bad at this game. Uh, I'm trying my best to make sure it... I'll be honest. I don't think there's a harder game. Oh, was, that, was that the bomb? I don't think the... Like, the hardest PlayStation 4 game I've played was Killzone. And that game was... I don't know what it was about that game, but you're talking about brutal. Yeah, there's armor just scattered everywhere. Let me hop on this turret really quick. What are we supposed to do? I guess this is kind of if you had... Yeah, there's no point in doing that. There we go. Let me run back to the other area really quick, because I might have been able to do that. Okay, so you don't have to do it in both areas, just one or the other. So, I picked that, so that's... Yeah, this is where we're supposed to be going. I was gonna try to squeeze the entire first mission into this video. I don't know if it'll happen. This game is incredibly long, so we'll just have to see. Disable the cannons, alright. This kind of reminds... I'm gonna be perfectly honest, this reminds me a lot of Rage. I played that game. Oh, I played it like a long time ago. 
If it's the length of that, it's going to be a long game. But I'll do the long videos like I did with that one. Finish it up nice. Holy shit. That, just, that took all my armor off, didn't it? So my my biggest concern so far is just maintaining the like the ammunition and uh, the health and everything. That's it's really as long as you can keep that up. Ooh, what the fuck? Did you see his body fly up? Well, I'm requesting backup. I feel like I'm unstoppable. I might have to up the difficulty a little bit just to give myself a little more challenge. Can I shoot through the floor? No, you can't. I'll say if you could, that would be so sick. So they, they all went back down, so... I'm pretty much good up here. Yeah, if you're thinking about getting this, I, I think it's on a discounted price right now on different consoles. I would have to say that I think it's worth it, though. If From what I've seen and played so far, it's definitely... You're definitely going to get your money's worth. Alright, so we're still running around. This level's pretty long, so I'm just trying to cut up some editing a little bit for you. So I'm not just... Holy shit. <laughs> His head came off again. Here we go. Let's pick this stuff up. Yeah, there's so much stuff scattered out. It's like I'm trying to collect as much as I can, but it definitely has that doom feel to it. Where you're running and gunning. There's just a lot of enemies. Like, there's no way this would actually happen in real life. Ever. I do like the... The amount of gore is not overdone, but it's just the right amount. Kind of reminds like the Gears of War head pop when you snipe somebody. Look at this jackass. Uh-oh. Here it is, guys. Oh, no. It's turning this way again. This can't be good. This can't be good. Oh shit. Come on, go, go, go! There we go, I got I got one of them. Oh nice, nice. Oh fuck. 